Today I have this unfinished nativity scene that I picked up at Hobby Lobby for $19.99 with 50% off. And I did find one at Dollar General for $3. I also grabbed this pack of paintbrushes from Dollar General for $3.50. Now each piece I wanted to paint pretty simple. I started with uh, chocolate on each of the pieces, front and back. And while they were wet, I then started to add some color. So here I added goldenrod to the star at the top of the manger. And then here's baby Jesus again, the entire thing chocolate. And then I started with Wise Owl, Snow Owl for his face. I jumped to Bowie for the blanket and for his head covering. Like he was swaddled. The Bible says he was swaddled in a manger. Then I added some Republic red to the white to give him a little pink tone to his face. And then I just did a crisscross motion with the goldenrod to appear as hay. Here's Mary, again all chocolate. Snow Owl for her face. And her hands. A little Republic Red for her added into the white to give her that pinkish tone. Then I'm using Bowie as her head dressing, her head covering. And here is Smoky Quartz for her garment. And I added just a little bit of white to give it some dimension. And then blended it in. Here's Joseph. Started with Bowie for his head covering. Snow Owl for his face. A little Republic Red to make it pink tone. His hands white with the, with the Republic red. And then I'm just outlining him with some snow owl. The camel brown with goldenrod. I'm using Spanish moss for a blanket on the camel. I gave him an eye and a little bit of hair on the top of his head with the golden rod. And then with the snow owl, I created these tassels going around the blanket.
Here's the angel. Now I created her all white and used goldenrod for her wings. Guys, my video got cut off and I don't know why. I apologize for that, but I just did the goldenrod on her halo and on her wings. And I also did the white with the Republic red to give her a pinkish toned face. Now here's the sheep, again all snow owl. And I took a fine brush with some smoky quartz and just made these swirl motions all over the body. And I did give him an eye. And I made these uh, triangles at the bottom of the feet just to give them a hoof appearance. Here's the shepherd. I started with goldenrod. This cutout was a little bit more difficult, so I just decided to take that point and create a beard. And then I went over this with uh, Bowie for his head covering and made it appear like the top of his hair was sticking out of the top. This was almost like a headband with a long flap. And then I just continued down into his garment with the Bowie. What I love about this is there's no right or wrong. Guys, you can do whatever you want. Then I just started outlining him with white just to give dimension to his garment. Now here are the wise men. Again, chocolate. Goldenrod for their crown. Snow Owl for the face. A little Republic Red mixed into the Snow Owl. And then each one I did a different color. I did one in mandarina. One in Republic Red. And one in Smoky Quartz. And then I just added detail to each one to give it interest. And these are the three wise men.
Guys, this was a really fun project. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it gave you ideas for your own. If you'd like to see other tutorials, you can go check us out on YouTube. You can now watch all of our videos at chalkitupfancy.com. For any paint products, brushes, tissue paper, or transfers, chalkitupfancy.com. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Thank you so much.